Hello friends, welcome back to my channel Instrument Calibration. If you are new on this channel, then please subscribe this channel and press bell icon to get notification when we post new video on channel. In this video, you will learn What are two types of pressure switches? What is fail safe condition? What is proof rating of the switch and what is burst pressure? Why is it undesirable to have very little differential pressure or dead band in a pressure switch? First of all, what are two types of pressure switch? There are two main types of pressure switch. First is mechanical or electromechanical. Second is electronic or solid state. Let's first understand, what is mechanical pressure switch? Mechanical switch has diaphragm or piston. This piston opens or closes circuit when the pressure in the medium rises or drops to a certain value. Every time the pressure reaches the switch point, the diaphragm or piston transfers the pressure to a micro switch. Secondly, what is electronic or solid state pressure switch? An electronic pressure switch is based on an electronic pressure sensor. It is often referred as pressure transmitter. Electronic pressure switches integrated electronic switches used to open or close the electric circuit, and it performs simple control tasks. As you can see from the picture, electronic version of pressure switch has digital display. And it has adjustable switch points, and considerable higher reliability. Now, what is fail-safe condition? In fail-safe condition, pressure switch is wired such that, any loss of power will cause the alarm to activate. Generally this means that, the control system will alarm on a logical zero or zero volt. Therefore, under normal, healthy operations, the control system will receive a logical 1 or 24 volt from the pressure switch. As you can see from the picture that, we have taken normally close contact of pressure switch. This normally close contact gets open, when any power loss or power failure occurs. In addition to this, one normally close push button is connected in series with pressure switch in order to check the system. Now, what is proof pressure rating in pressure switch? And, what is burst pressure? Proof pressure is the maximum amount of overpressure that can be applied to the pressure switch without causing damage. In order to check proof pressure rating, pressure switch can be exposed to pressure reaching proof pressure rating, and be expected to work properly when the pressure returns to within the rated operating pressure range. If pressure surges or spikes are anticipated in an application, a pressure switch with high proof pressure should be selected to avoid damage. Burst pressure is the amount of overpressure applied to pressure switch at which the pressure switch will certainly be damaged. Pressure switch may be damaged at any point between the proof pressure and burst pressure. Now, why is it undesirable to have very little differential pressure or dead band in a pressure switch? Micro switch of pressure switch will chatter when the dead band is very little. This chatter sometimes cause permanent damage to pressure switch. In addition to this, if pressure switch is used to turn on the motor, this rapid contact changes force motor to turn on and off frequently. And this may cause problem to motor. Sometimes, motor winding will burn out because of this. Thank you friends for watching this video. I hope you really like this video. Please give me your valuable feedback in comment box.